But they, they, they trusted him. They believed on him. Now listen to this. And so, time and time again, they were with Jesus when Bartimaeus, the blind man, was healed. Jesus said, go get him. Remember that? They went over and got him. Him over there hollering, Jesus! You know, cut, making a, you know, a commotion. And he said, go bring him here. Now, they went over there and got him. Honey, and here they come. And they heard Jesus tell him, said, what, what do you want me to do? Well, that's, you know, <laughs> Jesus, what do you think I want you to do? I can't see a lick. I am blind. I want to be able to see. And that blind man was healed. And do you know them, them men saw it? They probably, they may have, the Bible doesn't say to do, but they may have even rejoiced with the man. You know, glad and happy for him. Amen. Well, they was there that day when that woman come to Jesus and she said, and she started hollering at Jesus and, and uh, the disciples wasn't even too happy about that and wanted to know if they should tell her to, you know, to stop, go away. And she kept on, have mercy on me. They were there. They saw it. Amen. And I won't go into the rest of the story. Praise the Lord. Now, those men was there that day on that boat. And they were out in the middle of the sea. The big, great storm came. I mean, it was looking bad. And we won't go into all that. But it wasn't looking good. And those being fishermen, some of them, they, they knew that this, this was not good. They knew it wasn't. And they went. And guess who else was on the boat? <laughs> Religion has left us with the ideal, or sometimes, not religion, I'm, I'm going to back up again, some misguided people. Thinking that if, oh, if you believe God, and oh, if you have the faith, you know, that you ought to have, and all this, and you're just right in the middle of the will of God, everything will be just smooth sailing. Well, if it was, if that was the truth, then there's all out of the will of God. But Jesus included. And we know better than that. Well, there they was on a boat, and it's about ready to sink. Jesus on this boat. <laughs> if anybody was ever in the will of God, it was Jesus. He said, I do always those things that please him. Always. Well, here they go. They're on a the boat. They're going to do what God said to do. And they're about ready to sink. So, and here these guys are on this boat. And they go back and, and they wake Jesus up and, and they say, Master, don't you even care? No. Boy, boys, you, think about what you're saying here. Don't you even, that's what they said. They said, don't you even care that we're going to perish? Don't you even care? And he got up and he went to the bow of that boat and he spoke over that thing and them disciples were there and they saw that. Didn't he? Amen. Then the very next thing that Jesus said to them, he said, why are you so fearful? Why? Take a look around. <laughs> Take a look. And that's where most people are. Take a look. Walking by what they see. Well, if we'd follow the life of Jesus and obey, and obey him and be obedient to him, we'd lose a lot of that. Walking by sight. Of thinking that that's dictating to us the will of God. It does not. Now, let me tell you something else here. That boat was about to go down. But Jesus told the sea to be still. Quit. Stop. And it did. And obeyed him. Now, now if, you, if you know that you're in the will of God, God said do this, 
and you're doing it, and you can speak to this thing, then which one's greater now? The peace that you have on the inside of you, the peace that you can speak out here, or the storm raging? Which, one's, which one is it? If the storm is greater, it would have overcame them, and that would be the end of it. So why, why should we walk by sight when we can believe God in, a time, in certain times and overcome every obstacle? Now, as long as we walk by sight, we'll never overcome them. But if we walk by faith, that's what Jesus did that day. He stood out in front of that boat. He said, peace be still. Peace be still. Peace. Well, when he said that, there was no peace. It was turmoil. But he said, peace. It just come just like a, just like a, just bam, and it was there. 